Hello, it's Silent here from Seeker Game. Just wanted to do a quick video uh, regarding uh, Stalker 2. Um, new game out on Game Pass. Um, I downloaded this yesterday, I just played it today, and I'm getting pretty average FPS on my uh, NVIDIA 3080 graphics card. And I just wanted to show the um, FSR 3 mod that you can do for free. Um, I've got it working in this game, so I'm just this is a quick sort of tutorial guide um, for the game. So, uh, firstly, to download the mod, just Google FSR 3 mod. It's the top link Nexus mods, and you want to download the DLSSG to FSR 3 Universal one. Just click on manual download there, you'll have to log in. Um, you can create a free account um, on this website. Once you've clicked that, just click slow download here. So once you've downloaded the mod, uh, extract it. And then once you've extracted it, open the folder. And we're going to be using DLL underscore version. Just double click that. And these are the two files here um, that we're going to be copying. DL DLSSG to FSR3 and version.dll. So we're just going to be copying those to the game uh, folder where Stock 2 is installed. Uh, so this uh, this guide applies to if you downloaded it on Game Pass. So if you've got it on Game Pass, head to the R drive or Solid State drive with the that you installed your game on. Head to Xbox Games, Stock 2, Content. Um, now there's two locations that I've copied and pasted uh, those two files to. So I'll just show you the first one. So this is just uh, obviously this bit here, content. Um, so all you need to do is just copy over those two files like that. I'm not going to do it because I've already obviously just done it. So copy it to here, content, and the next location is, so if you go, so content, stalker 2, binaries, win gdk and I just copied it to here as well um, so once you've done that you don't have to click anything just copy it and then let's load up the game ok so with the game uh, loaded it's compiled the shaders and everything um, I just wanted to quickly show just before we continue obviously you can see my graphics card there the uh, 3080 by uh, default doesn't support uh, NVIDIA frame generation but with the mod that we've just applied um, I'll show you that it's unlocked and working in the game so okay so I'll just do a quickly show you with my on the vault first um, so I'm running epic preset for the graphics and display is my 4040p uh, with the 30 so the frames with my under vault we're at 1605 it's about 50 uh, 55 then we'll enable frame generation uh, obviously DLSS is set to quality throughout this so frame generation on apply and we've installed it up to 94, 93. And the game is locked smoother. Alright, so I will just turn off my graphics card on the vault, see what we get there. Set, I'm getting about 64, 65 FPS on the same preset. And when we enable frame generation, that goes up to 110 FPS. And you can just see how much smoother the uh, frame time is, the line. So we've doubled it, 
pretty much in both uh, scenarios. So, I hope this has been of use. Um, if it has, please like and subscribe. And if you want to remove the mod, simply delete those two files that we copied over from the game directory. Okay, um, hope this has been of use. Have a great day.